is Alex. He's currently doing one of the best UK side hustles. And at the age of 22, he's been reselling for just two years now, making thousands of pounds in profit each month just by buying and selling the most insanely demanded items. So everyone, welcome back to the Correct Chief YouTube channel. As you probably know, over the past three years, we have helped hundreds, thousands, actually we've helped 40,000 plus entrepreneurs start a side hustle reselling. So if you wanna get involved with that, link's in the description as always. But we're gonna take a look into one of my favorite resellers and it's actually our own staff member, Alex, we're gonna go down with him, and we actually went down yesterday. We're gonna show you all about him, show him his unit, talk about how much profit he's made, and all stuff like that, so you can get an insight of what a pro reseller looks like, the level you can actually take reselling to. Profit. 80 pound profit. Perfect. Who says you can't resell with an RS3, eh? How long have you had this now for? Nearly a year. Wow. Yeah, next month. So wagon. Just from reselling, eh? Just from reselling, Just from reselling. Eh? What's been your best month ever? From reselling. Best month ever. This month is gonna to be top three. Easily top three. just from yeah, just from air fries alone. Yeah. I think probably back in twenty twenty, when with the hot tubs and the weights and that. How much did you make? It's about seven thousand in one month for profit. Seven thousand yeah. in a month for that, profit. That was, that was literally like seven a.m. in the morning to like ten at night every single day. Just didn't stop. Selling. Yeah, well, I wasn't. I wasn't working, so I was literally had nothing else to do. Back in twenty twenty, it was May, May the thirteenth. You remember the day? I remember the day. It was my mate's birthday, and I saw a TG put it on a story. Yeah. Thirty pounds, and then the next the next slide was like uh, hot tubs, like two hundred pounds, two hundred pounds to run my profit. I was like, surely it can't be that easy. Yeah. So I remember I was like, oh, for thirty quid, I'll just give it a go. So did you like look on the website and stuff like that, like, or did I you literally like? I saw her on Instagram mainly. Yeah. It was like TG, and then obviously I was following Crep Chief. Yeah. And I saw TG kept plugging it, and I was like, well, TG's legit. Yeah. He knows what he's doing. So then went on the website, signed up, and then joined up that same day. I just spent the first day literally just in the chat, the whole throughout the day, yeah. just in chats, just speaking to people, getting some tips and that. Because obviously there were people in there who'd been there for a while, yeah. like a few months from making loads of money. And uh, there was this guy called Nick, and he was just telling me, he was like, so you need to go to B&Q the next day, be there for like 7 a.m. in the mm -hmm. morning for when it opens. I was like, well, I'll give it a go. So yeah. I went out the next day, got two hot tubs. It was Chester, I think it was. Came home, brought them back, and then I, I phoned my friend to come down with me. Yeah. We both drove down, and I think we got another four hot tubs there between us. And then came back, and I sold two the, on the same day. What was you doing like when you started reselling? Uh, so I was working in mum. I was working in mum's care home, just doing yeah. admin stuff. And I hated it. It was like nine pounds an hour. It was just awful. Just so boring. Crazy. And I think when COVID hit, I was like, I don't really want to be in a care home. Yeah. Working stuff like that. So I thought I'd give it a go. And then, yeah, by the next day, I'd made like 200, 300 quid profit and I still had another four hot tubs to go. So I set aside, I think it was, set aside about two and a half thousand. Yeah. Just like, that's, that's a lot. You don't need that yeah. much to start off with. But I set it aside and then just, I just didn't, went straight into it, went right at the deep end. I tried the Forex stuff in like 2018, 2019, and I was like, oh, all these groups look how did Yeah, how did Forex go for you? Yeah, I got scammed on that did one. Did you? Yeah, how much did you lose? It was only like 300 quid, but yeah. it was still, like, I was 18, so 300 pounds at that time was a lot. It was still 2020, it was like probably on September time, and hot tubs had dropped off. I think we were out a lot down for maybe a month or two, so yeah. wait till it sort of dropped off there. But like, I was, I was worried about it because I had my, my, my GTI and I was like, well, I'm not working, I need kind of need to pay for this each month. But I was still making enough from like the other flips, it was like, it was like a like a garden shed thing. Yeah. They were about fifty six pound ago, and I was getting there from B and Q and selling them. But I've never really had a a, a time where I've, there's nothing being reselling. Yeah. There's always something to go. An average spray, a couple of Rolexes, and a few holidays Definitely for thirty pound risk at the start. Best thing I've ever done, yeah. Best you thing. reckon? Yeah, I would not be where I am today if it wasn't for spending thirty pounds. <laughs> Look at this lovely Irish spray. You want an Irish spray? Start reselling. I'm gonna go check out his unit, see what he's got in there, see what he's got to sell. Talk about profits, talk about how much profit's sitting in his unit. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> so Alex, we're at unit now. Talk to me, how much profit is sitting right in there? Probably five, six thousand once it's all sold. Five, six thousand profit, Just are you on there, smoke? Yeah. How there. much from just the air fryers? Uh, we've got a 1.5k, including them. 1.5k, yeah. boom, 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 boom. Hundred pound profit, 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 hundred pound profit. 
profit for days, everyone. You know, you said you got these from QVC, you said you got these from Curry's, for these from Costco. How did you know when these were able to buy? The crypt you've notified at me. It popped up on my phone. Obviously, it's a little bit faster than Discord. And then just click the link, UVC, click the link, check that within two minutes, went back and got more. They got cancelled, but literally just everything through the app, all these. So hey. how can I get that app? Download it on the app store. Download it on the app store, so I'm not. App yeah. store, Great. on the screen right now, link in the description. Boom, 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 download it, start making some profit, happy days, and um, yeah. Crep Chief Notify app, boys. It's got the restock for you, these are all the products that I've just restocked. Uh, AF400 there, 229 to buy, 400 pound resell. Digital edition for PlayStation. Uh, another 60 to 100 pound profit there. Disc, another 80 pound profit. Then we've got the new bars. So these are all the products that are going to be dropping. This is the latest one. That is around 120 pound profit. And you can also get notifications. So for in-store Prime drops, Costco drops in the store, will also remind you on the day and the day before. So that was a look inside one of Crep Chief Notify's resellers. Take what you want from this, but reselling is here to stay. It's been around for many, many, many years. And if you want to try reselling, then click the link in the description and start now. Reselling is booming right now. And I'll see everyone next week for our biggest video yet. Sun came out. I went about to drop top. Party on the block. Looking like a car alive. Fucking on thoughts. 